Listen to a conversation between a student and a university service representative. Hi, I want to get a pass for the intramural activity center this quarter, please. Sure. I need to see your student ID card, please. Okay, thank you. Now, which type of IMA pass would you like to buy? Um, I don't know. How many different kinds of passes are there? Well, there's the basic pass that allows you to use the basketball courts, the fitness center, the racquetball courts, the rock climbing center, and the indoor track. An IMA super pass lets you use all those things and also the swimming pools, tennis courts, and golf driving range. Then we have、mm, specialized passes for just the swimming pools and the fitness center. Man, I didn't know this was going to be so complicated. Um, so the basic pass includes basketball, the fitness center, racquetball, and、uh, what else? The rock climbing center and the indoor track. It costs fifty dollars for the quarter. And the super pass has all those things, plus swimming, tennis, and the golf driving range, right? Yes, that's correct. The super pass is seventy-five dollars for the quarter. It also permits you to use the IMA center during the two-week Christmas vacation if you're going to be here. So the basic pass is fifty dollars for the quarter, and the super pass is uh seventy-five. But the super pass it gives you two extra weeks. And um, you mentioned there were also special passes. Yes, we have a swim-only pass for thirty-five dollars. This lets you use either one of our two swimming pools, plus the sauna and whirlpools in the locker room. There's also a pass for the fitness center only. It costs forty dollars and gives you access to all the weight machines and fitness machines, as well as the locker room, sauna, and whirlpools. All right, let's see if I've got this straight. The swim pass is thirty-five dollars, and the fitness center pass is forty dollars, and both of these include access to the whirlpools and saunas in the locker room. Correct. Oh, and one other thing I forgot to mention is that the fitness pass includes a fifteen percent discount on all of our IMA sports and fitness classes. What kinds of sports and fitness classes do you have? Oh my, we have several different kinds of dance classes: yoga, aerobics, swim conditioning, taekwondo. Here's a brochure with all the details. Thanks. So these classes, there's an extra fee for them, even if I have a super pass. I'm afraid so, because we have to pay the teachers' salaries and the cost of equipment. Okay. Uh.、Um, oh yeah. What about someone who isn't a university student? Is there some kind of pass they could buy? No, I'm afraid not. IMA passes are only offered to registered students and faculty. Guests have to be accompanied by a student or faculty member. They pay ten dollars each time they come. Can students pay the same way? I mean, each time they come? Yes, but if you're going to come very often, it's better to buy a pass. The student price is five dollars per visit. If you use the IMA even once a week, you'll save money buying a pass. Well, thanks for all the information. There are so many choices. I can't make a decision right now. I'll think about it, then come back later in the week. No problem. We're open Monday through Thursday from eight to twelve, then one to four thirty, and from one to five thirty on Friday. If you have any more questions, you can call the phone number on the brochure.